up. He's not giving up on it. I like that choice. So we see both players using their main characters for this matchup. As a spectator, I love this choice because it allows us to see Quick's crazy combo game. Once Quick gets a potential opening from a nuclear or a grab, you go. you're going to see insane combos and a really good advantage state. Quick trying to wait out an air dodge there, which lets Longo recover back into the neutral game. But yeah, and crazy we have a, combos can be had here. And due to the tri-platform layout, it's even more possible to see some crazy up-air strings off the top. Okay, good awareness to jump there and not do the normal get up into the uh, down smash of Susu. Oh, he and has no visibility. Okay, quick not going for a punish on the ledge. It's difficult to cover though. It's very difficult. It's a bit uh, like people think it's super easy, but you have a lot of options still if you're the one recovering. You could go for an aerial and stuff like that, or just don't get the edge. So it's not easy, of course. Yeah, and for Zero Suit Samus, only down smash and down tilt are actually able to hit the grounded opponent other than flip kick. And all of these options can be covered by Longo throwing out another up air before he grabs that ledge. So it's re a pretty much a 50 50 situation yeah, there, right. even if he has no invulnerability. I see, yeah. But back into the match. Currently, we are quite even. Quick trying to get these back as much. Punishing the up smash with up B, but Rob is so fat. Damn. Even yeah. with rage, not enough for the kill. Longo's doing a really great job at not now doing the he has no in. That was. Wow, I thought the back air was going to hit by Rob. Oh my god, that was. Wow! The tech. That was so precise. And so difficult to tech on Battlefield because it's yes. just. What's really he oh. doing? He's fiending off stage. Okay, barely surviving that. Wow, that man tricked death twice now. Still surviving. <gasps> what a snipe there. <laughs> that would have killed. Oh my god. Okay. Wow, he did not go for the grab there, even though he landed right. <laughs> What's happening there? Why is he going for the up air? I was saying, an insane situation where both players are at 150%. And it's just the first stock, too. Yes. Now pretty much every move is going to kill. And still no confirm, but that's it, that's yes. Enough. Nice coverage of uh, the jump with the Paralyzer there. And now you have full rage CSS oh, on Battlefield. that was a wicked. Air dodge read maybe, possibly, no. Nair gets Longo out of that situation. Oh, that Nair is so close to killing all the time. Yeah, some shield pressure and... What's he doing? I didn't he got expect uh, Quick to get hit at that late. Yeah, but still, we got the kill with the Nair, finally hitting. Oh, misses the combo, and now it's Longo's time. Another interruption by Quick. Yeah, air dodging that uh, laser. Okay, that's a combo opportunity. Some good damage. Rob's not the character that has these long strings, but some solid, small ones. Quick trying to get a ladder combo situation going. Yeah, he's positioning for them, isn't he? Yeah, he's positioning for them using Zare and Nair to try to confirm into a grab or anything. Longo's doing a really good job at yying it out each time. Yeah, good Who's punch out of shield there. It's not easy to punish that Nair, it's quite lackless of him. And, wow, nice raid at first for Longo, but not quite getting the timing on the two frame there. Yeah, Long kind of aiming to punish oh. the beefy upbeat that Quick has been doing there, but Quick yeah, has right. the awareness to not go for that again. Yeah, and that... Yeah, that's it. Yes, even though Rob is really fast, he's not fat enough this Yeah, game. Paralyzer into boost kick sealing that game one for Quick here. Yeah, so two times he got the kill confirmed through Paralyzer. So Long should look out for that option at the edge the next games. Right, so Quick actually taking the first game. Yeah, first game has been taken, but of course it is a very long best of five. Longo still has every opportunity in the book. He has a counter pick advantage, goes back to Battlefield. He's confident that stage was not the problem. He's staying the same character. He's confident in his skills to adapt to this situation. To adapt to the Paralyzer, not get hit by that anymore. And maybe this time that intense situation in the first stock, maybe this time he can decide that for yeah. himself. It was really close after all, so no reason to doubt 
your character choice there. I feel like Quick could press his advantage state a little bit harder in this matchup because um, Rob doesn't oh. really have any real escape options other than flying away with the up B. And using Nair. <laughs> yes, Nair is pretty slow though, so it's... Uh, if, ah, if you mean as a combo breaker? Yeah, yeah. Okay, and that doesn't work. More like the option to land. As an option to land, of course, he has the neutral air, and he's doing that pretty well. So I think that Quick should adapt to that and start maybe covering... Oh. Ooh, Almost Lango. getting the gyro. Oh! Reed. Oh, no confirm How did that. that not hit? I'm mad. <laughs> that, that grab went through the Ocean Samus there. All right, Quick gets another time, another chance to live. Percentage is looking pretty even so far. Nice tomahawk grab by Longo, waiting for the air dodge, but Quick doesn't give it to him. He was out of the range, I guess, for the true 50-50. Nice conversion with the laser. Racking up the damage here. And he's trying to find options against that DP up. He just tried to drop a gyro yeah. right in there, but it didn't work out for it him. It seems to have some nice priority also, because it just ran through the gyro. Okay, that's another opportunity. Yes. Nice wait for the air dodge. Kind of unfortunate the eye if you ask me by Longo to go in. Makes it a bit easier to chase with an up air. Yeah, if he had the eye that out, um, DSS doesn't have a kill throw. Even if you eye that F throw out away from the stage, you're potentially looking at an edge guard, but not to die right away. And of course, Longo using the battlefield platform now to use his up throw to kill 155%, but still, a kill throw is a kill throw. Yeah, right? even without rage. So one stock to one stock. Can put longer one point on the board, or is Quick going to extend his lead to a 2-0? Three wow. dash attacks in a row here for Longo. <laughs> Rob's going to work. That looked so funny. Like, go away. Like, Rob has such an interesting movement. Like, he looks so hectic at times. You know what I mean? Yeah. And that was so good for Longo that the gyro was right in his yeah. oh, great we got spot. Wow. So... Long as we using some really nice setups here. Still, Still getting the air, dodge. the air dodge. Not happening for him. Yeah. Grab oh, nice. confirm. Grab confirm. And trying to chase him, but Longo wisely jumping away in this situation. Wow, and that spot dodge crucial here as another beep boop situation would have ensued. Quicksilver looking for the back air. Oh, that's a punish. And now, is does he immediately up here? No. He waits ah, it out a third time, and third time's the charm for Longo here. Evening out the score, taking a sip of his water, he deserves it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, so we're at 1 1 score. Quick doesn't get the DI on the uh, up air there. It's kind of hard to DI, him, of course. And that. Makes it an even more potent kill move. Yeah, and I like the high-level mind games there. Longo waited for the air dodge three times, and other players might have said, well, this guy's not giving me the air dodge, so I should up air immediately. No, definitely not. Yes. I, I, at this level... It's not that easy. It's you cannot just easy. say, he just used that option, he's not going again for it. Like, that's like the basic thing to think, because, yeah, it's kind of obvious in that sense. And now we're on Smashville, which is also a really great stage for Quick in this matchup. The platform helped him so many times against Scythe. And let's actually see if it maybe helps him again here against Longo. Nice wait for the tilt after the area when he was should dance. She tends to use some uh, tilts after doing like up air on air. Oh! That could oh. be a spike. Almost killing. Yeah, I think in that situation, Quick actually underestimated how big Rob's hitbox is. And now the up B out of shield, almost taking that stock. Sweet spot is really difficult to hit on these really big characters because you have to press the button from really far away. And I think Quick just didn't quite expect it to be this big. Yes. Nice Down coverage smash of into the F smash, yeah. edge options, getting the roll. And I like that he goes for the easy, consistent option of uh, F smash instead of trying to confirm it to flashy down the stuff that might end up not working out for him. Just take the easy, consistent damage or kill. Because yeah. 
Yeah. Style points are style points, but no one's paying you for that. No <laughs> one's your placing doesn't increase because you have style. That's a good point. Unless your name but is. But you can style. hype up the crowd. In the crowd, you cannot forget that. That is right. Oh, Longo had the read on the roll there. Yeah, he's so good at getting these roll reads out of him down to Nice pressure on the shield with the back end to jab. Of course, Quick is trying to hold this, that lead by not getting grabbed at this percentage. But nice uh, projectile combos. Oh, yes. Yeah, that's, that's very optimal punishable. punish. Yes. Jesus Samus up tilt while being very fast also has a lot of ending lag. So it can be punished really hard. Wisely going for the forward there to get him off the stage and hold him in disadvantage. Yeah, no reason to go for multiple up airs there. Oh, that's a confirm. Rob off stage. And another back air. Longo has to think of an off stage option right now. Almost getting almost getting the kick. And he could have gotten a bury here on Rob if he had flip stooled him, but he decides to press the button and kick, reading the normal get out that didn't happen there. Ah, you're right. Yes, he had two options there. But he's still in the lead. Can down still smash, hit some good hit. back airs or down smash. Yes, he's taking the taking the damage right now. Oh wow! Ooh, reads the jump there. Strong very play by Quick. Very good timing on that back air, reading the jump and getting. Another win. So now 2-1 in the lead. Yeah, very strong lead here for Quicksilver and counter pick advantage going to Longo, but I have to say that second game that Longo won was also I feel like Quick had some good like small little flubs here and there that Longo was able to abuse that Quick just didn't give him this time around. And if Quick keeps that level up and Longo doesn't manage to adapt up to it, I can see Quick moving on to Grand Finals here. Yes, but Longo's so in too. a good mood, look at him. He's smiling, he's talking to Quick. Yeah. Does, doesn't look like he's flustered at all. That is the correct mindset. That is the mindset that you can carry to game five. But Dreamland, super scary here. Of course, it is yeah. great for Rob. It is an insanely good stage for Rob, but this is definitely by far the best stage for Serious yeah. Samus here. So, obviously, a risky pick in that aspect. But he has to be a bit risky right now because he's back and uh, he has to make something happen. And the confidence, of course, to say, yeah, I know the stage is great for you, but it's also really great for me. That confidence is really important here that Longo has it. It's good to see. I think so too, but so far Zeus some uh, quick in a small lead. But we're still in the neutral game. Yeah, we get some gyro setups. These are the small things I really enjoy about watching Rob. All these uh, gyro placements that lead into grabs or down tilts. Yeah, but prime percent oh, oh. dangerous. And yes. there's another air dot read. The Longo special by this point. I don't think. I think there was one time against Blub where he went for the up air super immediately. And other than that, he's always been waiting it out and serving him really well so far. Oh yes, getting the kill so early is always a nice thing. And quick looking for a way in, but Longo's not giving any space to him. And the Gyro actually covers the jump out by quick, <laughs> planning 10 seconds ahead. What a mastermind. He is a mastermind. Oh, no, that's Almost so Almost getting it. Yeah. Quick didn't cross him up there, so he didn't get the F smash. That's a nice punish. Okay, yeah, that's a, that's, a, that's a stock that's well deserved by Quick here, but still a sizable lead held by Longo, and he's gonna try to build that up into the next stock to finish in game five. Yes. Nice coverage with the gyro, getting the roll, and potentially a combo setup. It honestly kind of looks like Quick doesn't know how, how to get in. 
Looking at Lee, it doesn't look like it. But he's proven so far that he can do it at... Yeah, if you whiff that grab, you have like 68 frames. Where you 68. can just see eight. That's insane. It's more than a second where you can just put away a controller, take a drink, <laughs> like, okay, yeah, just punish me for that. Yeah. Think about your punish and then go for it. Yeah. No big yes. problems in infinity. I think that. that pivot grab was meant to uh, cross uh, Longo up. He didn't manage to get behind him. Yeah, yeah, he no. wanted to cross about death with you. Yes. So, but like frames in this game work weirdly in a way. Sometimes it's really ri hard to. Uh, Run past someone. Yeah, you're right. It's uh, I don't I don't think this is the first time that we've made that observation today, uh, where it's just difficult to know whether you're crossing someone up consistently. But Trick has been doing these setups a lot, where he tends to roll past people, and then when they don't really expect it, he does a pivot grab, which in the animation for CSS actually, if you look at it closely, looks really similar the dash in the beginning to a roll. Yes. So that's a funny little mix-up that he does, but didn't work out for him this time. And yes, game and now five. we got game five going. Doesn't get anything out of the bury though. So we got another game five. Speaking for the very similar skill level of the players we have here in the tournament left. So both players currently in the neutral, trying to get a setup for a potential combo. Exact same percentages for these players. <laughs> oh yes. So dead even end. There's the grab. There's an up it. Oh, oh, I felt like step ladder was possible there, but really risky because if he falls out of the up B, you're not gonna get anything out of it. And Longo actually takes oh. that stock really quickly. Now he's in the driver's seat for game five against Quicksilver. Germany's number four player running up against number three and telling him, hey, wait, I should be above you, right? Let oh. me show you why. That was almost a very unfortunate gimp there. But it didn't happen, so Quick still in the position to take the stock and we got an even game. Game 5, last stock for both players. Who's gonna go into Grand Finals? Yeah, it's all about that one opening. Longo doesn't have the privilege that Quick has right now, where just one really strong opening can already mean the end for Longo. CSS is super scary for him. Yes, but in exchange, uh, Rob has some very strong projectiles that he can use to uh, force his opponent to approach. Yeah, and not afraid to go in here, Longo. Tries to go for the shield oh, grab. Frame. That's almost a tech chase. And now what's gonna happen? I feel. Okay, that's not gonna kill yet. Not yet. Looking Trying for to chase the down B. Sizable percentage. And what now? And what now? What now? He that's it! Yes! Longo in grand final, beating out quick. Wow. Okay. Wow. I would not have expected this to happen. Not with Rob of all characters. Yeah. Great and job. Just behind to Longo. two one, and then managed to get the comeback, the three two comeback. Well like played. Yeah. In the beginning, he didn't really get these uh, 50 50s, but in the end, even more. And when it matters. He clutched it out. Right. And now we have Tom and Emo waiting in loser semifinal.